so I just sneaked out of the back gate at Sterling Oaks and I'm going to get to Village Walk hopefully in 15 minutes. No laughing for anybody who knows what the distance is. I'm not going to break the rules. Just all the lights are going to be green. I'm going to will them green. I'm going to get there. My photographers are coming early. I took an expired listing and I love the expired listings because I love figuring out what went wrong um, and redoing a little bit of stuff. So what we're doing on this one, <clears throat> just like we did on our last couple of expired listings, a lot of times it's the presentation. It's all about the presentation. And this particular unit is a beautiful unit. It is priced right. It is even offered furnished. I know that the person that buys this property is going to want to winter over in this unit and it just needed restaged and it needed great photos, not okay photos, it needs great photos. That's one of the things that I love doing and a lot of people don't know that back in the day I did work a lot in interior design and even had a furniture store. Uh, so I love going in and deconstructing what people have and reconstructing it so that we create a photo, a vision of the possibilities of a home. And sometimes that means uh, minimizing what's there or removing a lot of what's there. And sometimes that means just embellishing what uh, what is left for us to work with. And sometimes they are vacant and there's not a thing in there, not a towel or anything. So, um, and it's not necessarily filling a home with furniture. Sometimes it's just making it feel like it has not been abandoned. Um, so I'm on my way to Village Walk. We'll have a new town home coming out of the market really soon with some great photos. And um, I don't have <clears throat> permission from the last agent to publish their photos so you can see before and afters. You just have to take uh, my word for it that we, uh, first of all, we balance the rooms and we create some visual um, vignettes so that people see it and it compels them to want to breach the threshold. And if you cannot get a consumer to cross the threshold and look at a property, then you will certainly never get them to buy it. So tag along. Um, hopefully I can link together a couple of these posts and somewhere down the road you'll be able to see this video with the finished product. Have a great weekend.